Hello for Lover, what's up? My name is Matthew Fremo Salapu, also known as Anonymous, uh, creative director for the show for the Luminati as part of the Open Arts Festival Whanui program. <laughs> Well, I've, I've always grown up watching my father engage in a lot of Fasa more stuff where he's standing there with his toto in the foyer and it kind of reminded me of battle rap going at it using words against the other orator and it had this village or family behind them and I was like hey that's kind of like a battle scene you know growing up as a big hip-hop fan this project provided the best opportunity to kind of bring those two words together that of social culture hip-hop culture and traditional ethnic Fasa more culture Yeah, I'm like the crossroad. The one that watches both sides and makes sure no one scratches each other's face. What I loved about it is the opportunity for our young ones to be actually interested in our own language because it belongs to them. Without that communication, everything breaks down. Family breaks down. We don't even connect to each other anymore. It's very rare that you see a show done with projection and rap and salmon oratory going up against each other. And I just hope they walk away feeling like they're more closer to the oratory side or more closer to the hip-hop side. Whether it be they came in one-minded thinking about hip-hop, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then after hearing the salmon oratory is thinking, oh, okay, there's some similarity in there. For the Luminae, it's just something this generation's making between two generations, the previous one and this current one, to kind of influence the future to come. And also projection is not just a literal thing, it's also that double metaphor of, it's a projection of where we see hip-hop culture going and more culture going in the future.